one of the things that we are very clear in Franklin Pierce about is the way you train is the way you will react in a crisis. So we train you every day in that preparation. Franklin Pierce School District doesn't plan alone. We bring in Central Pierce Fire and Rescue. We bring in the Pierce County Sheriff's Department. We bring in the Health Department. We bring Pierce County Department of Emergency Management into our planning effort because we know those agencies are gonna be there when we really need them. We're not alone. We have three full-time deputies assigned to us that they are there for a resource, but they're also there to have fun with the kids. We did an event um, recently called Donuts with the Deputy. One of our school resource officers went into two classrooms and had donuts with them and talked about who he is as a person, how he got to his career in law enforcement, and why he loves being an SRO. Um, so these guys could be out on patrol, but they choose to be in our school because they want to make an impact in those kids' lives. When you visit um, our schools, such as Elmhurst, the Early Learning Center, and Midland, you will see that system in place today. Um, and that's where you will push a button, the office staff interacts with you, um, they ask you why you're there, they may ask you to show an ID, they vet that you have a reason to be on campus and that you should be there, and then they get you into the building. As our new elementary schools come online, all of them will be an access control building with a visitor management system in place. At some point, Every school in the Franklin Parish School District will be an access control system. If a building calls, I go and help them and be a response and to provide that district perspective or guidance to a building that's in need of that. Not a single one of us wants these events to happen inside of our school. It's an insurance policy. When you have a plan, you have a policy you've trained that you may never have to use that but I'd rather have the plan and the training and the people than to have it happen and not be able to have that resource. And so I always say for my superintendent and to the parents and guardians, I would rather write a plan for everything and nothing happen than not have it.